Hello everyone, welcome back. This is uh, Daniel's castle, the place uh, where we are staying uh, this uh, weekend. This is a uh, nice uh, accommodation, an old uh, castle adapted uh, to a hotel. Dating uh, from 17th century in Transylvania, Romania. Here is inside uh, the room uh, where we are staying. It's a nice room. It's called upholsterer's room. All the rooms uh, in the castle are different and named after the crafts uh, that were um, in the past. This is upholsterer. This uh, colored uh, upholster on the wall gives a cozy and uh, warm uh, feeling. It's very nice. It's a playfully decorated uh, room. There are still um, original old elements like these uh, wooden uh, poles on the ceiling. Let's do a quick uh, sketch uh, with a brush pen in my sketchbook. Let's start with the rooftop that has uh, the shape of a irregular hexagon. Then uh, the side of the rooftop for sides like this. Let's uh, fill in quickly with solid black because uh, on that side of the building it's the shade. Then quickly adding a chimney, adding uh, the walls the front side of the building this is the front side where the sun hits uh, the wall so we'll leave it white then uh, the side wall which is in the shadow will uh, cross hatch it to make a shadow uh, part of the building in the middle part there is uh, this entrance of this uh, triangular shape and uh, there are some uh, round uh, columns. Now uh, let's add uh, six uh, windows on the rooftop. This is like a mansard so the sun goes from the left, so this uh, part is in the shadow on the right side. Adding uh, the floor ground windows, three on the left side and uh, two on the right side. And here we have an arched entrance completely in the shadows. The cool part of sketching with um, this kind of pen is that you can make a very quick and uh, loose sketch because you can do either thin or thick lines and uh, the lines are very expressive. Let's do the the door, the entrance door, like this. Quickly adding um, the shadow part here on the right side. Also, it's in the shadow. Here, another column. Here also. Here's in the shadow. Let's cross hatch like this. Here are some stairs. Here we have another shadow part. Look how easily you can do it with the side of the brush. Just adding a, a thick line. So when the shadow is ready. Let's add some detail at the ground level. Here is some stonework. 
just a quick representation. It's not uh, very precise, just to suggest that it's the stonework. Now here in the foreground is a bit uh, empty space. Let's add some bushes and to balance the composition like this. And here we have uh, some um, decorative uh, stonework. And here pathways that go to the castle like this. They are in many directions. To do just a few of them to balance it. Adding uh, a few trees in the background just to balance the composition a few bushes like here here we have another tree some hills in the background like this also the rooftop we can make some suggestion that is made uh, of tiles we don't need to represent everything, just a few suggestions. Then uh, the viewer's eye will uh, complete the whole uh, image. The, here are also some stones, some gravel pathways, details in the shadow. This is a loose, a quick sketch the castle let's date it 30 october we took a trip to burgish gorges which is near to daniel castle it took us uh, 25 minutes driving there what is interesting about this natural preserve in the middle of transylvania is uh, that it has um, over 120 caves that can be uh, visited by tourists. You don't need the special equipment, uh, just uh, a flashlight. Also in there, there are hosts of bats. There are many, many species of bats. I've seen a couple of uh, bats hanging uh, down the high ceilings of the caves. The caves are uh, quite large, you don't need the uh, special equipment. Uh, uh, also, you can uh, walk uh, in there. Also, they are situated uh, on the um, very steep uh, rocks, but there are uh, steps or uh, pathways also, there are many trekking pathways, um, climbing uh, routes, also cycling routes. Um, you can uh, see the very fast uh, river, Burgish River. Also, you can traverse it uh, over um, many uh, bridges. The access is very easy. Uh, I think uh, the routes some of the routes are uh, for beginners and uh, also if uh, you want uh, advanced routes uh, you can climb or um, go uh, even higher. In this uh, natural uh, reservation there are uh, many species uh, of plants and flowers. There are evidence that in prehistoric times uh, the caves in this area were inhabited by uh, prehistoric uh, humans. This is a, a fortified church that in old times uh, was used to uh, defend uh, against wars. The walls uh, around uh, the church uh, were defending uh, people who were gathering there during the war times. There are um, many uh, fortified churches in this area of Transylvania, in uh, Kovasna and uh, Harkita. They are um, 
they have uh, many uh, German uh, influence uh, architecture. I like the villages in this uh, east central part of Romania, namely in Kovasna and Harakita, because of the architecture of uh, evidence of old time uh, craftsmanship with uh, its uh, churches and uh, houses. This is the view from uh, my balcony. Let's uh, sketch it uh, quickly with uh, watercolors. I'm doing uh, here a gradient uh, for the sky. While the sky is drying, I'm adding for the foreground uh, this paint's gray. For the rooftop, I'm using uh, sepia color. For the white of the building, I'm using a mixture of uh, sepia and uh, ultramarine, making sure that uh, I don't touch the previous uh, layers that are still wet. Adding uh, details with a smaller brush, also sepia. The surface is still wet and uh, I think I need to wait more. This is quick uh, watercolor sketch I did uh, this morning. For this uh, quick watercolor sketch I used uh, this uh, watercolor sketch pad from Arches, cold pressed, 300GSM, 100% uh, cotton. Then I used uh, my watercolor Rembrandt uh, portable set, 12 half pence colors, various brushes of uh, various uh, sizes, Windsor & Newton synthetic brush, Tintoretto synthetic brush, they're excellent for watercolor. Masking tape to frame the picture. And uh, this uh, watercolor, um, this water container, foldable water container from Faber and Castle. Thank you for watching, I hope you enjoyed it, see you next time, goodbye.